Now we are going to make the blend of the aggregate. Here, in order to fill this table, first of all, I will have to fix the value of small a, small b, small c, and small d. Here, I am going to take this value. A is equal to 22.5 B is equal to 14 C is equal to 21 D is equal to 41 and filler E is equal to 1.5 when these values are multiplied with the A we are going to get this result and I am going to tabulate it because I had already told, told you that this video is a continuity of my previous video in the previous video I had made the column over here, I am going to show the result of multiplication only. It will be 22.5. It will be 21.5, and 0 0.1. Similarly, for the second, 14, 14, 13.3, 0.7, 0.3, 0.1, 0.03. 21, 21, 19, 7, 4, 1.9, 0.8, 0 0.6, 0 0.4, and 0 0.2. Then bin number 3, and after that bin number 4, 41, 41, 41, 41, 36, 9, 14.4, 9.4, 4.9, 2.1, and 1.8. Next, about this filler, because it is 1.5%, 1.5, 1.5, 1.5, 1.5, 1.5, so this is the result which we have obtained by this type of the multiplication I have tabulated over here. Now I have to convert all this result into this equation. Means I have to make the sum. When I am going to make the sum of this value, what I am going to get? So this is the total. After getting it comes out to be 100. 99. It comes out to be 82. 63. 43. 18. 12. 
सेवन फाइव फोर एंड फोर पॉइंट थ्री थ्री पॉइंट फाइव दिस इज अवर टोटल एंड दिस टोटल विच इज गिवन ओवर हेयर लेट मी हाईलाइट इन सम अदर कलर लाइक आई एम गोइंग टू क्लाउड इट दिस वैल्यू विच इज बींग क्लाउडेड This value is known as the combined aggregate gradation. Let me tell you again, this value which has been clouded over here, this value is known as a combined aggregate gradation. Just from this gradation, you know, in the two point three six, what's the value coming? Forty three percent. And what is my PCS? Thirty nine. it means that 43 is higher than the 39 so it means this blend which we have obtained over here which is given the name das1 design aggregate structure number 1 it is having the characteristics of uh, fine in nature let me show you this value in is graph then it will be easy for you to understand This plan one design aggregate structure number one. This graph is like this. This is the maximum density line, and along with this maximum density line, we have the control points. and we have the pcs and my graph is coming like this one so it is above so this combined graph which we have obtained over here it is fine in nature Have you followed this one? Now, next, what will we do? I have not dropped this value. This is the value for my DAS one design aggregate structure number one. If I have to make DAS two, what will be? If I change the value of A, B, C, D, and E, our combined aggregate gradation limit will change. just keep that thing in mind if i am going to change the value of these parameter our combined aggregate gradation will change now rather than going to make the table every time i will just mention the value which have been changed here a was this one here a is 24 Here B is twenty two. Here C is thirteen point five. Here D is equal to thirty eight. And here filler, which is represented by E, 
it is equal to 2.5. When I am going to write down this value, rather than making the table again and going in detail, that is a just wastage of time. I will just write down the limit that what I am going to get about this uh, 19, 12 .5, 9 .5, 4 .75, 2 .3 .6, 1 .1 8, 0 0.5, 9.5, 4.75, 2.36, 1.18, 0.6, 0.3, 0.3, 0.15 and 0.05. What I am value going to get? I will just write down this value. Here 100, 99, 80, 55, 40, 17, 12, 7, 5 and 4.2. So this is the combined aggregate gradation for design aggregate structure number 2. Still, if I see this curve, because this is the 39, it is 40. This curve will go little bend. This curve will, will be like this. It means still this curve is above 39, so it is again fine in nature. For my DAS2, design aggregate number, number 2, this curve is again fine in nature. Now for the my DAS3, design aggregate structure number 3, let me change the values of this. Here A is equal to 19. B is equal to 35. C is equal to 15. D is equal to 29 and filler E is equal to 2. You see values are changing. When these values are changing, then this combined aggregate gradation value will change. Over here, this combined aggregate gradation value will come 100, 99, 83, 47, 32, 14, 9, 6, 4, and 3.4. This is our combined aggregate gradation after the combination of this one. Now again your critical point. Here the value is 32. When the value is 32, it means my gradation will change. Over here, my curve will come out to be like this one. Now you see, my curve is under 39. So it is not fine in nature, it is coarse. It is coarse in nature. So D8 number 3 is coarse. So from over here, please let me tell you again, value I have given over here, this limit I have also derived over here, it's not good, I will go on wasting the time for each and every calculation. If you will go through all three, four lectures in series wise, you can make this value yourself, then after drawing the graph, you can analyze, analyze the graph that design aggregate structure number 1 is fine, DAS2 is fine and DAS3 is uh, coarser. The question is, 
why I have made the three design aggregate structure? Its answer is super paved mixed design require at least three design aggregate structure for uh, making this design. Thank you for seeing this.